Hey guys, Lee here, Theme Park Ohana. We're gonna take a quick peek at the Polynesian entrance that has reopened. Um, I know we haven't had a lot of content lately. Me and Jen are just, she's getting ready to go to Oregon and help her dad move. So we've been spending a little more time off camera together. So we apologize, but here in the next week or so, we should get back ramped up to normal because we have a lot to see at the Magic Kingdom and actually all the resorts with all the new little statues, the 50th statues. There's a lot of new 50th news that has broken that we got to check out, but just stay tuned. Um, again, Jen's getting ready to go to Oregon, so we're kind of spending a little more time together before she goes because it's going to be a long couple weeks. She's doing this long road trip, but let's go check out the Polynesian. Alright, so I kind of don't like this. There's really nowhere to get across the street to the main park unless you come way back down off to the right here. I don't know if it was like that before. I kind of remember being able to walk right up to the Polynesian. So I'm not a big fan of that. But again, I could, it's been so long, I could be remembering it incorrectly. Wow, this looks amazing. And I think they had these little ball lights before, but everything looks so good. Not bizarre the way they did the concrete like this until you get over here. But once you get to the main concrete, it almost has like an animal print, almost like the back of a turtle, if you ask me. I like the stones inside very pretty i don't like oh i like this so that looks almost like a lava stone here with these big new planters very pretty so you still have a lot of construction going on so a lot of construction pods vehicles this area seems a lot smaller to me but let's check out the water features as we walk into the lobby again this is going to be a short video i'm just showing this basically man how pretty is that they should have benches sitting here so you can just watch this this is awesome now that was the left side this is the right side again all new new decking new stonework all of this is new i almost feel like they're new trees as well this looks so different to me. And the actual waterfall is kind of loud. But Polynesian main entrance has reopened. No additional changes to the lobby. Still the beautiful Maui Tiki and the flowers and the lava rock underneath. I believe those are irises and they are gorgeous and I'm even seeing the Lilo and Six surfboard that has survived so far but one's got to think it stays have to be numbered I'm not currently upstairs and man does it feel good to see no screen look people walking in we got security guards over there for the monorail just didn't look right all shuttered up at some point Jen and I are gonna have to get these Polynesian pennies because I can't imagine they're gonna stay forever Lilo and Stitch because the one next to it 
doesn't have Moana, and everything's kind of going towards Moana. So I can't imagine these pet press pennies are going to be around much longer. If I had some coins, I'd probably do it today, but I don't. So, got to put this on the list of things to get done. Ooh, these stitch cups are absolutely new. And the bottom basically goes to the roof of his mouth. So it's more like an 8-ounce cup than maybe a 10 or 12-ounce cup. But it's cute and it's new. I've never seen it before. $22.99. You know how me and Jen can never stay away from shopping for too long. I just I'm just looking at the toys and I don't ever remember seeing these Pixar toy box figures. They are cute. They got Buzz, they got Jesse and Slinky, and then you got Forky and Woody. I wonder if there's more to the collection. Oh wait, yeah. Coming soon, that looks to me like Sully, but there is a Bo Peep, there is a Bullseye. That's interesting that they would have a Sully. And these are $14.99. I've never seen these backpack plushes or keychains i'm not quite sure i guess you would more call it a keychain although it does, it's not real practical but 15 dollars, and it's from the yolani resort i'm guessing it's Moana. her hair is a little crazy not real practical cute and affordable at 15 dollars so much like the overhang for the bus drop off this is what we saw those balls and now I don't really want to get into filming security because I know they're, they are not huge fans of that. But this is the best view I'm going to give you of the monorail entryway. Kind of looks the same. I believe it has all metal railing on the side. of It used to be wooden. I could be wrong. Definitely looks different. But I, again, they don't, really don't like you filming security. So I don't really want to get any closer. Well, I guess I should take a quick peek at the boutique before I leave. You never know, they might have something new. And Jen and I are addicted to shopping. I can finally admit that now. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. Heather just got this for Jen. It is like the best fan ever because it has stitch. It is epic. Some of these youth hats look new to me. Like, I don't recognize that one. That one. And what's the, oh, off to Neverland. These are all youths for $27.99. Well, maybe they're not youths if they're $27.99. All right, so I just saw someone actually come out of the dressing room here. So as of right now, the dressing room here at the Polynesian store, the boutique, is open. This music has me feeling like I'm watching Lilo and Stitch. <laughs> has one of the best soundtracks ever. In this guy's opinion. Anyway, oh, gotta do the Disney point. This guy's opinion. All right, that's gonna do it for me. Like I said, this was gonna be a quick one. Um, just had the stroller drop off here, so figured I'd real quick take a quick video. Show you guys the new entryway to Disney's Port Orleans Resort, Port Orleans. Show you guys a new entryway to the Polynesian Resort here at Disney. It looks great. They did a, a fabulous job. Um, got a little bit of new merch, but if you guys like this video, please hit the like button. If you're not subscribed already, please do. Ring the notification bell so you always know when a new video is headed your way. Thank you so much for watching. And now I'm gonna take this mask off and we're on to the next adventure. Bye guys. Today's video brought to you by Orlando for Families. For amazing prices and even better customer service on all of your stroller rental needs for your Orlando vacation, visit them at the website listed below, www.orlandoforfamilies.com. Use the promo code OHANA to save 15% off of their already competitive prices.